look at that. Let's see that again. Oh, let me get you perfectly. There we go. All right, guys. So this car, we've made a couple Vegas trips in this car, and it was out in the blistering heat. Both times, it was around 110 degrees outside, so you can imagine the, um, the wax uh, being put to the test there. And uh, on the right side, we have Trinova. Left side, we have Cullinite 845. And the rest of the car has 845. Beads perfectly fine still. And then right now, it looks like it's uh, it might be done. As you see, it's sheeting off pretty nicely on the Trinova side, and it's a little slower on the 845, which is interesting. I mean, the car still beads pretty nicely, too, for six months. I mean, my six-month video of it is out. It's interesting. I wonder if it's because of a... Uh, huh. But, yeah, I mean, shout-out to Trinova. That, that wax is still holding up pretty nicely. See it's sheeting off. I mean, the 845 is still sheeting off, but it, it's going much slower than the uh, Trinova side. Good job, Trinova. That's <clears throat> it's pretty impressive. <clears throat> I'm guessing the hood took... I'm sure the hood and the roof took the most beating out in Vegas because this was left outside, you know, over over a two-day trip, two, three-day trip, whatever it was. Anyways, that's the update. Trinova's still holding up pretty pretty good. You, so I wouldn't look past them. It's a pretty uh, good wax, especially it's affordable too. I think it's like 15 bucks or something, 15 or $20. Um, yeah, that's the update. Thanks for watching.